If you didn't notice, Minecraft Manhunt has been steadily falling on Dream's channel now, and it's been getting less and less views from when it peaked back in like 2020. And Dream has been doing content for three years now. The Dream's been making Minecraft Manhunt for almost two years now, and it's slowly been falling in views, and I think I know why. So the first reason that it's mainly falling in views is because the hunters are getting better at the game. When Dream originally made his Minecraft Manhunt video, it was only with George. In the nicest way possible, George wasn't the best Minecraft player out there, and Dream could easily overpower him even though he did lose the first Minecraft Manhunt. As more Hunters got added and they got better at the game, Dream struggled more. And if you don't remember, Dream actually tweeted saying that he couldn't actually record the video because the Hunters were too good and he kept dying too early. This just shows that the Hunters have gotten better over time. I mean, at one point, Sapnap was just this guy and now he's actually one of the best Minecraft players out there because he's steadily gotten good at PvP. He's almost comparable to Dream. The other Hunters have their own skills and that's what really nails the coffin for Dream. I mean, if the hunters are too good, he can't really record a video and he's just gonna struggle. So the second thing is Dream's actually pretty controversial. Now, if you didn't know, Dream's probably the most controversial YouTuber out there and this guy's been dealing with controversy for like three years at this point and everyone hates him. Not really, he has stands, but a lot of people don't like him. And when people don't like you, they're not gonna watch your videos. And that's what's happening. I mean, Dream's been in so many controversies with his friends or himself that people have slowly started losing respect for this guy. I mean, he lost a lot of respect when he lost the Technoblade, and with the accusations coming around his friends, even though knowing they were fake, a lot of people still are mad at him for whatever reason. Now, it mainly just goes down to the fact that he did cheat in one of his speedruns or just other things, but in general, People really stopped liking Dream mainly because he just was mixed up in so much controversy and some of the people just don't like him. And it all ends up going down to Dream's behavior. I mean, he doesn't really care what his stands do, he cheats in some of his speedruns, and everyone just kind of hates him for that. But a lot of people still like him, mainly his stands. Now, one of the biggest points, and where I actually make the point that Manhunt is failing, is that the repetitiveness. When Dream originally came out with that Minecraft Manhunt idea, it was original, it was fresh, and people started watching it, and well, they got hooked once Dream actually started doing it seriously, because he made his first two videos, and then didn't make one for a little bit, saw success in the series, made it, and then he just completely went insane. And when he originally started blowing up, he was doing Minecraft Manhunt, and everyone was watching it, but no one was making videos on it. He's been doing it for so long that he's milked it to the point where it's the same thing. Dream running away from his friends and at the end he either dies or he doesn't. There's nothing new. Obviously there's new strategies, but it's getting very very similar and that's why a lot of people either stop watching or he gets less retention time. Fifth and the final one is very similar to the fourth one is competition. So originally Dream was obviously like one of the only people who was making Minecraft Manhunt content, but in 2021, a lot of new creators started making it, showing off their own skills. Now, they were nowhere near as good as Dream, and he was classified as one of the best Minecraft YouTubers, and no one could really stand up to him. But since there's so much more Minecraft Manhunt content out there, Dream is just one of the many YouTubers who makes it. Sure, he's the biggest Minecraft YouTuber, but people are doing other different types of content based around Minecraft Manhunt, like coding something or having different types of rules. This really mixes it up because for almost a year straight, everyone just had to see the same Minecraft Manhunt with the same Minecraft Manhunt rules from the same creator. And now there's variety and that leads to competition between the creators. And truly, this is just what's been happening. I mean, I made another video on the full uh, rise and fall, and this video is just a better explanation of the fall and how it really happened. He's not even cracking that many views, he hasn't uploaded in a month, and no one knows what his next move's gonna be because no one has any idea what it's gonna be. If Dream truly wants to keep his channel, he has to make a new series.